Alrighty, I've had some questions about um, feedback or like myths. I turned in an assignment and now I have it back in my to-do list. So there are two ways to know if you need to redo an assignment and to find feedback. Okay, so the first is on your main page here, right? You have your classes. Mine are all literacy classes because those are all the classes I teach. Okay, and you have your to-do list and your activity stream. So if you click on activity stream, you can even sort it by course. So if you want to check just your literacy course, you can totally do that. Okay. And I see right at the top here, I have an assignment where I have a 70%. I have this little curved arrow here, and then there's a little speech bubble. Okay. This curved arrow means that I need to redo it. Okay. And then this speech bubble means that there's feedback. So I can view the feedback right here on my activity stream. And I can just click the click here to view feedback. Okay. And if you click there and it doesn't freeze, there you go. You'll have it load up. Here's my feedback. It says, please follow the prompt and make sure you, that you are reading the rubric to know what it is that you need to do. Hey, sometimes my comments are as simple as that. Sometimes I'll include a link to a video that'll help you out. Okay, any of those sort of things. Okay, so just know that this icon here means there's feedback and this icon here means you need to redo it. Okay, there is another way to see feedback on your assignments. Okay, so you can go into the class. You can go to your to-do list. And you can see, I, I can see right here, I need to redo 3.03, .03, organize your narrative. There's no feedback on that one. Okay, so if you have something like that and there's no feedback on it, it could be because it's a quiz, it could be because you turned in nothing. Okay, um, but I've even been putting feedback on most of the ones that turned in nothing. But then I have this one here that shows that I have feedback. So I can click on it. And it says the status is completed, retry allowed, has feedback, below passing score. Okay, here you can see what I attached to it and then the, the attachment that the teacher attached to it, which was also me, but, you know, teacher me. Okay, and you can see the directions up at the top. Okay, but it says it has feedback and I saw that little icon, so where is my feedback? Well, you need to hit view grade details and then down at the bottom, it gives you the feedback. Okay, see, this is the exact same as what we saw on the activity stream. It's a little bit easier to get it through the activity stream than it is to do it that way, but whatever works for you, okay, that's your option. Um, so that's how you see feedback so that you can make changes to your assignments if you're able to redo them.